Bradford Skolmore Crematorium is situated close to the outer ring road at Lidget Green. There are two entrances, but the main one is along Necropolis Road. As you go down the driveway, you can park on the left-hand side, or you can park in front of or behind the crematorium by following the one-way system. There are two disabled spots opposite the crematorium building, although at the time of filming the markings were quite faded. The waiting room is to the right of the main entrance, clearly signposted. On the window you will see a list of the day's funerals so you can check you're at the right time. Through the waiting room is a corridor you'll use to exit the chapel. Here you'll find the toilets, including a disabled facility in the vestry. The hearse pulls up to the main door and the coffin is taken in through there. Mourners usually enter through the door next to the waiting room and follow the coffin on its way to the catafalque. The main mourners usually sit at the front left, in front of the lectern. If there are to be donations, the box will usually be positioned on a stand to the left of the door immediately after the toilets. This door takes you out into a conservatory where you can stay for a few minutes to chat. The Book of Remembrance room is off the waiting room. Should the chapel ever be full, you can watch and listen to the funeral service via the screens in the waiting room. Skolmore Crematorium is set in beautiful grounds and some of the gravestones and memorials are huge. There's a garden of remembrance where cremated remains can be scattered. And there's also the snowdrop garden where deceased babies are remembered. The memorialization areas for cremations and also where funeral flowers can be left are just outside the conservatory.